Hello, people. Okay, this is the winner of our Charles freaking fantastic freaking edit. I kill him. This is Taylor, guys. So, okay, Taylor, hit us with your questions. Um, what state do you guys live in? Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. All right. <laughs> Just I like, okay. Right. Rosewood does not exist. <laughs> okay. Um, um, I've been seeing a lot of, um, he's freezing up. You're freezing. Uh, My Wi Fi's on. Hold on, it says poor connection. Is that better? Yes. Yes. All right, go ahead. We didn't hear what you said. Okay, um, a Toby's twin theory. Um, when Spencer said that she saw him dead in the woods, um, what if she actually did? And Charles is actually Toby's twin. I would throw my I will TV kill someone. Literally, I would kill somebody. I never, I didn't hear that theory. I haven't I heard that theory either. yet. So they're saying that the person that was in the woods that was died Toby. was actually yeah. Toby? But I thought yeah. that they saw his face, no? Like, when the girls went into the thing, didn't they see his face? Of the person, whoever it was, and it was just some random dude? Well, it said, like, it had the same tattoo, though, so I thought it was, like, relevant. I will literally throw my fist through the TV. I, I, that would not... It's my TV and I would let her do that. Uh, see, my thing is, is I don't understand because, like, we know that Allison has, like, kind of, uh, not like a history, but like a little history with Toby. Um, uh. I would feel like if he was going to be Charles and had the twin, he, yeah. like, it. To, that doesn't make sense to me. Right? Does that make sense to you? Um, he no, we knew his then, mother, and I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know about his mom either, so that's why I kind of just like. That's true. Know. We know nothing about Marion. We don't. We have no freaking clue. Uh, we're supposed to find that out in the finale. We'll see, but we'll see. I don't know. I don't. That would not make me happy. I would be very. I'd be very disappointed. Disappointed with that. Because it'd uh, kind of be like doing 312 all over again. Yeah. Only kind of not. Bullshit. Well, like, kind of like segues. Well, that's the same thing with, like, Ezra. Um, how he was already getting blamed for the whole eighth thing. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly why so, we we don't agree the with the Ezra thing either. No. Yeah, in the last episode, um, I don't know if it was, like, just put in there for coincidence. I don't know. But it, I thought they, like, made an effort to show his ticket to L.A., like he was trying to leave like is it planning to leave the, the way that i took that i could be wrong but the way that i took that is that yes we see that he has a layover well he says that it's a layover on his way to thailand i think that it was shown to us perhaps because of the time he, jump right of the time jump that he's never going to leave la and him and aria are going to wind up together that's how I took it. Yeah. Like, uh, we've gone through this whole Ezra being Charles possibility. We've and seen pictures of Ezra, like, yeah, as a kid. I a just, lot of it. I'm seeing a lot of it, too. You know? And if they do, I'm not saying that they won't make him Charles. I, I ha Literally, I've lost faith in a lot of this show. Um, they could absolutely make him Charles, but it wouldn't make sense, and it would be a lot of plot holes. Agreed. Yeah. Um... Okay, so I didn't know if this was ever mentioned, but I play this game called Quiz Up, and I was like number one in Indiana for Pretty Little Liars. Whoa, um, we've played and, it. That's pretty. Whoa. whoa. And, yeah. So there was a question on there that I answered right, but I seriously never knew it was even a thing. What did it say that Jessica had an affair with Bethany Young's father? Yeah. Well, it, did. it. We were meant to believe that because when Bethany, when they're listening to the tapes of Bethany's recording or whatever, she, she does mention about Mrs. D having an affair with her, her father. Okay. All right. She does. Yeah. I was just like, well, maybe if Bethany is alive, that is maybe another reason for her trying to get back. I don't know. Maybe she killed Jessica. I don't know. Thank you. 
bang. He's still there. Um, <laughs> yeah, Sorry. we don't. Um, that's crazy. You're number one in Indiana for the yeah, quiz, was, uh, quizzy stuff. Yeah. Well, that's pretty cool. Um, if it's so, not seriously, Gianna can attest to this. For how involved in this show we are. I could, I literally cannot tell you what happened in the fucking past five seasons. Like, I'm, because it's, it's all convoluted and confusing and. It, to us, this show has no, no rewatch value, like replay value whatsoever to us. Like, except once for season done, five, of course, because. Well, we were in it. But hey, once this yeah, is done, what? like, we're done. Like, I'm not, I don't want any of them on DVD, like, I, because I just, I can't relive this shit all over again. Even though we'll know yeah. answers, but I. Even though we have it on DVD. Well, yeah, well, but do. whatever. Um, alright. I think Ren will be a, I want him to be Charles. Tell him but... my man. But. <laughs> I had his face, like, right Oh, hold on, there's the a fucking truck blasting down the road what else is new in this neighborhood go ahead um allison's face at like the very last few seconds made it very like weird because she seemed like she knew him i really 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 honestly feel this is my own opinion and i could be absolutely 100 percent incorrect i really feel that whoever that was was not charles i feel like whoever that was is either going to be red coat or it's going to be mona and if it's Redcoat, it's going to be doing the dirty work for Charles, getting Allison to where she needs to go. Because we know that there's two of them running around that night. One of them freaking locking the the moms in the the basement, and the other one yeah, is Charles at the dance. Charles works alone. Yeah, it, 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 none of it makes any but sense. I really but I really feel like that person that we see, I really have a feeling that it's not going to be Charles. I mean, I, I, I have no doubt that we'll find out in the beginning of the episode who Charles is, but I also feel like I'm not 100% positive that that person was Charles. I feel like it's either going to be Redcoat, and that's why she's surprised. Like, she's going to be like, what? Like, whatever. Or I feel like it might be Mona, and because we know Mona plays a very prominent role in the next episode. Why the hell wasn't she in this episode? I just yeah. feel like it was a little weird. I don't think that's Charles. Uh, that, uh, but if it is Charles, we don't know. Um, we Just really to let you don't know. know. Rode off down the street. Good on his bike piece. We really don't know. Um, we've never seen any kind of interaction with Ren and, and uh, Allison, so we don't know if she knows him. But we also have to keep in mind that Allison was keeping tabs on the girls when they were. When she was supposed to be dead, she was coming back, visiting them. So she knew a lot about what was going on in their lives. She might have recognized him that way. And we also said in our um, finale discussion video that we posted on Tuesday night that if, in fact, it was Ren that she was talking to Emily about in the Halloween episode uh, where she says she knows a doctor, blah, 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 because all doctors are Ren... That was then, just a little weird that they did put that in there. I know a doctor. I know a doctor if you control, need. Whatever. Yeah, exactly. So, who knows? Um, I'm kind of confused about in season three. Um, Mona said something about the lines like red coat. You know, she's the like reason for all of this. Like, you know, she's like the leader of it all. Yeah. Is she like? Is she? more of a reason for all this than what Charles is because I'm seeing like the like the preview for next week's episode it's like he looks like he's about to kill himself like jump off the building or something like I don't yeah know. I don't buy that I don't know if we're blaming him for too much of like I don't know um okay this is where it gets confusing because again it's like you have to take everything like at face value because honestly I don't trust Marlene King anymore anything she says like I really don't but she is claiming that Charles is a Charles is the one that stole the game from Mona so yeah. I feel like Redcoat might just be helping him I don't really feel like she's in charge of anything I feel like Mona might either one think that Redcoat is in charge 
before she found out about Charles because no let's be real who the fuck would have known about Charles like nobody knew about Charles but I feel like maybe she didn't know about Charles and thinks that Redcoat was in charge or I still have a very bad feeling about Mona I really really do I don't know why I can't I can't shake this feeling I have about Mona, and I don't want it to be true. I don't want her to be bad anymore. Like, I want her to just be fucking normal, but I feel like we're gonna find out that she's more involved than she says. Do you wanna hold it again? Yeah. We're passing you back and forth here, Taylor. All right. Um, if Ren does not, in fact, be Charles, uh, do you think he could be one of the black hoodies and maybe trying to help the girls? I feel like if he's not Charles, I don't, I don't know, um, what his reasoning would be for just, like, helping somebody. Um, also, uh, that tweet that I talked about before. Yeah. Uh, somebody tweeted one of the production assistants of Pretty Little Liars. Uh, the person's name on Twitter, I believe, is Here's a Clue. Um, they tweeted Here's a Clue, and they said, Can you give us a hint as to Charles's identity? And the response from that person that's a production assistant said, 410, as in episode 410. Episode 410 is called The Mirror Has Three Faces. It's also the last episode where we see Ren, and it's also the episode where he was drawing the picture with the barn and the red coat and the kid being tossed in the air and Checkerino everything. living his life out through fucking art. So I, I really, if you take that into consideration and if that person is I really, to if that, he's then... not Charles, I feel like what what the hell could he possibly have to have do? to do with this whole why story? is he like why and granted i understand he hasn't been on the show however his name has been brought up quite a bit that really pisses me off that say that oh my god ren hasn't been on the show that much but i think reese is a yeah like you think reese is a after two episodes of being in this but Ren, who's been in 20-some episodes, is so well, fucking hard to believe. Didn't they, Ren and Hannah kiss? Yes. Yes. So, yes, the hell they did. Like, that's, what, that's what I was thinking more of, like, Ren is Charles. Is like, what if, like, Ren still has feelings for Hannah? That's why she got that money for college. That That's a possibility. Um, I, to this day, would love nothing more than for... Ren and Spencer to be together because I can't stand Toby and I just want to kick him in the face. I can't stand Toby anymore. I can't. But I feel like Ren has a bigger part in the story that meets than meets the eye. And not like people are like, oh, you know, only 20 episodes. Okay. But can we think about this for a second? But First of all, Andrew, we didn't who know like who Charles... We didn't even know that there was a Charles until this season. Exactly. So, for this person to have this big, big role, it kind of makes more sense for it to be... Somebody a, who's been a, a character, a main character, but not like a an everyday character. It makes more sense. Somebody that we don't know their backstory. Somebody that we don't really know a lot about. It makes more sense for them. I'm going to ask another question. Ask another one. Alright. Um. Hmm. We're going to have to actually... Hold on. We're going to make this a two-part video. 